Hi, I'm Gaz. In today's video, I thought I'd tell you about how I met the legendary Steve Coy from Dead or Alive. So stay tuned to the latest episode of the G-Log. Meet radio and television personality Gaz Reynolds, the founder of World Domination Records and Great Drive Driving School. Like, comment and subscribe to be part of the journey. This is Gaz Reynolds, the G-Log. Welcome to another exciting episode of the G-Log. Um, as I mentioned in the intro, um, this video is all about the legendary Steve Coy, who was one of the longest lasting members of the band Dead or Alive. And of course, Pete, Pete Burns here, um, a pal of mine, um, he was the front man of Dead or Alive. Now, um, unfortunately, Pete passed away a couple of years ago and Steve passed away more recently in May 2018. So I thought it was rather befitting that I actually made this video, although strangely enough I actually had plans to make this video before Steve actually passed away. The last time that I met Steve and Pete was at the launch party of Man Made. Um, now Man Made was a photographic exhibition of Pete Burns and um, his photographer, Michelle Martinoli, who I went on to become good friends with and actually worked with, um, she decided to put on an exhibition um, in one of her galleries of all the works that she'd actually done with Pete, of photographs of, of him over the years. And many of these photographs actually went on to be on the Dead or Alive Greatest Hits album as well. Now, many people don't realise that Steve actually, even though he was the drummer in Dead or Alive, he actually managed Pete for many, many years. Um, and Steve himself was actually quite a quiet kind of guy. Um, he was very um, more interested in being behind the scenes, I think. That's the way I'd describe him. And he always came across like that, actually, when he was in Dead or Alive, when they were at their peak. Although he made a major impact on the actual visuals of Dead or Alive. Um, I can remember the early 80s imagery was absolutely fantastic. Um, I've got to say, I, I must say thanks so much to all the Dead or Alive fans that have been reaching out to me from around the world. Um, it's been absolutely wonderful hearing from you and I'd love to hear from you and how you found this video as well. Um, and I am actually planning to make another video about Pete and Steve, um, which will be probably in the coming weeks. Here's some interesting facts about Steve Coy. Um, Steve actually managed Pete, uh, a lot of people might not be aware of this, and um, Steve was really one of the main members and one of the longest lasting members of Dead or Alive, he was actually the drummer, but later on he went on to actually manage Pete as well, and um, as I understand it he was involved in Pete ending up on uh, Celebrity Big Brother, and Pete almost won that by the way. Um, anyway, uh, an interesting fact is that Steve actually lived just down the road from me and, and he was actually born in my hometown of Harrow, where I am now. Um, so again, that's another sort of strange connection. But um, I was very fortunate to meet Pete and Steve on many, many occasions. The last time I met both of them was at the launch of Pete's, um, well, it was, a, it was like a VIP uh, launch party for Man Made. Today's positive shout out goes to Keith Jennings. So there you go, Keith, you've had your shout out. Um, if anybody watching my videos would like a positive shout out, then please leave comments down below or you can send me an email. Um, now I have had thousands of requests, so obviously I'm trying to get through these videos as quickly as I can, but please appreciate that um, I can't feature absolutely everybody, but I will do my best. 
any Dead or Alive fans watching this video now will feel the sadness that I feel that we've lost two key members of Dead or Alive and unfortunately we won't ever see Dead or Alive again. But fortunately Dead or Alive's music will live on forever just like the memory of Pete will live on forever, an unforgettable character from the music industry um, and Steve's memory will live on forever and I'm hoping that Dead or Alive fans or anyone watching this video um, will enjoy what I've actually put together. Anyway, that's the end of today's video. So if you've enjoyed it, then please like, comment and subscribe. And don't forget to hit that notification button. Thanks for tuning in and I'll see you soon. Electric Out now, Gaz Electric. Reynolds' new album, The Electric Wedding Album. As featured on Big Review TV Electric and Radio Kama Harrow. Electric. Available Electric at iTunes Kama and Sutra. all major Electric. outlets worldwide. Electric.